Hey everybody, G4Video5 here and welcome back to some more Grand Theft Auto 3, the definitive edition in this part. We will be completing the mission Rig to Blow for D-Ice. Some effort's why my wheels to blow. If I lose those wheels, my rep on the street will be dead. Pick up my car and take it over to the garage on St. Mark's, alright yo? Let them defuse that. Let them take care of that bomb. The clock's ticking and the wiring is messed up. One pothole too many, and that thing could blow. Now move it! Ooh, yes, so St. Mark's is the destination we need to take D-Ice's vehicle to. And that seems like a very scary concept there. But it's not all that bad, as gang hostility is turned off during this mission. So you really don't have to worry about any of that unless you provoke the gangs themselves. So don't get into gunfights, <laughs> just put it that way. And so this mission is replayable, which is pretty cool because there is a little timer element. It's almost like a mini race in some way, like a time trial more or less. And so you can replay this mission for that purpose of beating your previous best time of taking this Infernus on over to St. Mark's. Or you can just use this mission to collect things like hidden packages around gang territories that are very dangerous. Speaking of dangerous, Here's the Porter Tunnel. So overall, not too bad while in there. Uh, there were a couple of moments where I had to slow down, but I'd rather slow down and be cautious than try driving somehow past a lot of those vehicles. As a couple of bumps and bruises, and this infernus can potentially end up exploding on you like a lady's clamshell. So you gotta watch yourself a little bit. You know, might get something in your eye there. And, uh, you know, thankfully, though, um, <laughs> as I'm driving erratically here, um, thankfully, nothing too drastic has happened yet. So, here's the garage in St. Mark's, right in the heart of St. Mark's, too. And it almost feels weird or wrong in some way, being back here with the Mafia not hostile towards us. So, I don't know, it's just a very, very strange type of mission. It's almost like Rockstar knew they kind of messed up or something. Because they gave the Mafia shotguns once we assassinated Salvatore. So, it makes this place virtually impossible to end up... Oh, hey, nice little stunt bonus there. Um, but it makes this place just impossible to traverse. So, thankfully, this mission exists. And also, unthankfully, we have the Porter Tunnel again. We're so close, yet so far away. <laughs> I mean, you could literally see the light at the end of the tunnel right there, so that's very unfortunate, but thankfully at this point in the mission, it doesn't really matter if you damage your vehicle too much, because you could just take it to the pan spray, and you don't have to worry about this vehicle exploding easily on you anymore, so that's quite nice. But now that we've dropped this vehicle back off at the parking spot location, we've now completed this part. In the next part, we will be doing the next DI mission... DI? DI's mission called uh, Bully and Run. So until then, I will see you next time.